a lot of things are happening today in this contraption called Nigeria. And it gives me great joy. I'm so happy. I'm so elated. I, look, I am so, so happy. A few weeks ago, I talked on the attitude of some of our political elites, some people that are styled themselves leaders, like General Danjuma. And I said, General, I talked about him. And the General at word, there's a great shaking. There's a great earthquake. And everywhere it's unsettled. And then we have to appreciate this individual. We have to appreciate those who have conquered their fear. Like those who don't want to be politically correct. Those who don't want to accept the CC any longer. I don't think that anybody can talk bolder than the way General Dajuma spoke. And he spoke the mind of several people who are too afraid to talk. This is a challenge to people like Tinibu. How long will you keep quiet and eat this shit, Tinibu? Senator Ahmed Bola Tinibu, how long will you keep quiet and eat this shit? You're a woman being. You're a woman being. Here, you boy, the mass of you boy, why a genebia? You're a man, I'm a man. Why are you making yourself worse than a woman, Tinibu? Get up and stand up and speak for your people. If you claim you are the leader, I don't think if Awolowo is alive, he would have accepted this. I don't think even the worst of Yoruba leaders, if they are alive, they would have accepted what you are accepting and putting the Yoruba people to ridicule and to shame. General T.Y. Danjuma, you have spoken our mind. You have made our day. And we are going to respond in the most equal proportion. If those people think that they can kill, why would others kill them? They're the only people who can kill. They are not from Taraba. They are in Taraba. They are not from uh, Mambila. They are in Mambila. They are not from Tiviland. They are in Tiviland killing people. They are not from Nebu. They are not from Iboland. They are in Iboland killing people. They are not from Orobo land, they are in Orobo land killing people. They are not from uh, Isoko land, they are in Isoko land killing people. And all of you are Did they tie your hand? Kill them back! We did not go to Zamfara to kill them or to Futajelon to kill them. They come to our land to kill us. And somebody is saying that uh, General Dandima. Why are people so afraid when somebody says, defend yourself? Is it a crime for a man to defend himself? Is it a crime to defend the honor and dignity of his daughters, of his mothers, of his wives, of his nieces, of his aunties, of a man or a woman to defend herself? Why are they coming to talk about what General Danjuma said? General Danjuma has spoken the minds of the greater 
greater majority of our people. And we salute his courage. We salute his courage in overcoming his fears in trying to be politically correct. If Buhari cannot be politically correct, if Atiku cannot be politically correct and say he's a full animal and try to make excuses, why should I be compelled to make excuses for, for my people that are dead? We that are victims have now become the villains. Why? Fear of me, Abibo son. We who are killed, we who are the victims, have now become the villains. You have become the victims. Now lie on our feet. Ani bro mongo. Jena dan chiofla dan juma. We may take them. How many black people are among We expect people like Tinibu and others to rise up and talk the same way.